Hello everyone, this is Dr. Nakul Ameta from Aspire MDS, again discussing over a frequently asked topic that are the cranial nerve components. Now we are all uh, familiar with the cranial nerves and we are also knowing about the nature of the cranial nerves. Either they are sensory, they can be mixed or they can be motor in nature. Okay, but still we'll see a, a mnemonic like how to remember them easily. So there is a mnemonic that is some say marry money but my brother says big brains matter more okay so by the, this you can say that wherever s comes that stands for sensory wherever m comes it comes for uh, stands for motor and wherever b is there it stands for both so that is a mixed nerve so we can just know about the origin of the nerves that can be some say marry money but my brother says big brains matter more so the first nerve second they both are sensory third and fourth are motor fifth is the mixed now sixth is a motor now seventh again is a mixed now eight is a sensory now nine and ten they are mixed nerves and eleven and twelve they are the motor nerves so this is how you can remember about the origin or the nature of the nerves okay now coming on to the main topic that is the cranial nerve components now we all know there are various components that has been asked various times they are given different names but to remember them we will have a mnemonic over here today that is save vaccine save ways okay now this save vaccine from this we have to remember we can write it right write it like this save a vaccine okay now this vaccine is of only v va which is uh, to be remembered again we have to write it like save ways okay now this entire part we have to divide it into two two letters that is the two letters from the uh, first word the sec the remaining two letters these two letters here we uh, go for two letters here these two letters and these two letters so entirely we are dividing into two two letters from each of these uh, uh, words okay now below them we can just uh, draw seven blanks okay these are the seven blanks because there are seven components in total okay now we have to write this letters what we have separated from this part from the words so s a from here v e from here here it comes as v a again here s a from save here it comes as v e here we take again as v a and here we take it as s e so these are the seven blanks which has been filled with the components unlikely with equal letters okay now always remember that something there is called as the spatial difference and that is spatial sensations and there are general sensations okay so always remember that spatial ones are always less in number and general are more in number spatial ones are three in number and general ones are four in number but always spatial ones comes before so taking three spatial ones we will place them as s s and s in the first three blanks and the general ones that has four general um, components that will place as g g g and g over here so this becomes uh, comes out as our seven components that are somatic spatial somatic afferent spatial visceral efferent spatial visceral afferent general somatic afferent general visceral efferent general visceral afferent and general somatic efferent now uh, as we all know that 
afferent are the uh, neurons which takes the sensations from the body parts towards the brain through the central nervous system whereas efferent are the neurons that takes the sensations from the uh, brain towards the part of the bodies so in total we can say that afferent ones are these uh, sensory uh, parts and efferent one they are associated with the motor sensations so these are the things that you need to remember so it has been divided into the seven components that we can see now again one thing that you need to remember or a statement that you can remember i'll let you know over here remember this statement that i am aged 28 and i stay on 5153 crossroads i like all the multiples of 12 except 1 and 2 i also like 11 okay so this is what you need to remember the statement so how we will utilize it over this uh, table so i am aged 28 we have to write 28 over here and i stay on 5153 crossroads cross means here crossroad okay i all i like all the multiples of 12 except 1 and 2 so what are the multiples of 12 as we know they are 3 4 6 and 12 that is because we have written over here except 1 and 2 i also like 11 so we have to write 11 also over here so these are the uh, things that we are getting as a rough table okay now there would be a something in common uh, on the remaining on the remaining in between lines so now we have we do not have to touch this first and this last line and between lines in the between lines over here now we have to fill them with 7 9 10 in common so everywhere we will write 7 9 10 7 9 10 7 9 10 7 9 10 again here 7 9 and 10 so this is your ultimate table by which you can remember your different types of components and just by making this table you can easily name the cranial nerves and their components so that's all for uh, this video thank you everyone